All right, new day. What's up, guys? How's it going? We're free and four eight. We got Rob here again today. Good, good help lately. We uh, so we've destroyed the Ford Escape. Epic jump. Can hold it this way. Maybe it was more light. Epic jump. So now we're working on getting an F one fifty. I thought I could pick it up today, but they're taking a few parts off it. So getting it Monday. So we're just gonna have a bit of a random day today. We got some freshy tools from Dewalt. So we're thinking, let's cut the roof off the Equinox. I'm thinking maybe if we put some fresh gas in it, maybe it'll run. Because it did sit for like a year, and then it sat down there. So I don't know if it sucked up some sediment or what. But we got some freshy stuff from DeWalt. We got a few impact kits. We got another saw. We got saws coming out the yin-yang. Wow. Some radios. There's the pressure washer from last time. So there's some radios and a... A, I can't even think right now, a grinder. So I've not had a DeWalt grinder yet. I've kind of just had a cheap one, a corded one uh, for a while. It works all right, but, you know, cordless is always better because you can use it everywhere. You don't have to plug it in. Is that the one that plugs into the lake or into the water? No, no, no. Oh, okay. that's not this, this is um, a uh, plug-in pressure washer, but, you know, you're thinking the, the power cleaner. It kind of looks yeah. like my big impact. And you can take it anywhere. You is can go the down the river. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Nice. So it's uh, not here right now. It's at the other house. So, I like that tool. Yeah, it's pretty handy. <clears throat> and then we got this today. So we got some uh, smart suites. So these uh, these are three grams a bag. I know I know we like our candy, but the older you get, you got to dial off the sugar. So anyways, this is low sugar candy. So three grams a bag. Usually it's like 10 grams a piece. And they have the best, peach rings are the best, I find. Those ones, then the gummy worms, the watermelons, they got all the good stuff. So there's a discount code below if you guys want to test them out. And we definitely go through about a box a week. So anyways, let's head down to the track, see if we can, I don't even know if I have any blades left. Oh, and I don't know if I showed you guys this, but we got assassinators now for the Maverick. Oh, yeah. Look at the lugs on these things. Like, there's my fist. <laughs> Uh, and we got pulled over in the Maverick the other day. So I hope you guys enjoyed that video. We're going to head to Toronto next and uh, maybe slap a beer case on the back and see if we can get pulled over there. So, <laughs> anyways, let's head down the track and see what shenanigans we can get up to. And we got a stray dog that just showed up today. So, the owners are hopefully coming to pick him up soon and super friendly. We just uh, don't know where he's from. He has no collar. So, anyways, let's do it. The old Equinox. She's a little breezy down here today, so we're trying out the microphone again. So we tried jumping the Equinox last week. It did not work. We took it to the top of the hill. We drove around for about 10 minutes first, and she ran good. We packed everything down over there, took it to the top of the hill to jump it, and it literally just started huffing and puffing and poofing. Yeah. So we jumped the Ford Escape. But I just put uh, about 10 liters of fresh gas in it. It's been sitting since last week so fingers crossed she'll get going but since we got some new tools from dewalt i wanted to test out this new flex bolt grinder and it's got a nice pottle break on it so seems aggressive oh, yeah. she stops pretty quick Sounds good. yeah and then we're going to use the sawzall to cut the roof off so i'm going to hand this off to you there rob it's a little tricky with the microphone. I'll try not to touch it. <laughs> yeah, should I be left-handed? I'm going right today. Let's see. <laughs> Ambidextrous. Let's just grind the uh, grinder names in there, eh? Mac? No, Mac. I'm just kidding. Mac. 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 Here's Mac. Mac. <laughs> Come on. the plastic. Hey, what's AOB? I know, right? I'm stripping <laughs> you for the Mac. Oh. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> there you go. It made it worse. Alright, let's get the saws on the old flex bolts and uh, see if we can trim that roof off. Oh, that grinder is nice. I've had um, a cordless one before, not DeWalt, and I actually returned it the next day because I hated it so much. So, 
It was smooth, I'm, eh? Yeah, that one's way better. The DeWalt one it crushes it. It's with light, the, too. Flex bolt. Yeah. So, all right, let's do this. Oh, we got a sunroof to work around. <laughs> Buddy, let's see this. <laughs> oh, man, I don't even know where to start. What about that window? Uh, can you Doesn't matter. Can you open the door, actually? Yeah. All right. down there. <laughs> yeah, it might be a good idea to cut here. <laughs> yeah. I got some more. Uh... There we go. Yeah, the pillars are usually the hardest to get through and then once you're into the, oh, the yeah? roof part, it's like butter. Smooth sailing. But yeah, these are pretty thick because, you know, obviously if the car rolls over, you want somewhat of a roll cage, so. Just make oh, I thought the blade broke. No, no, I just pulled it out. Now we're dulling this blade real quick. This is like a metal and wood blade. It's supposed to be wood with metal in it, but we're just doing metal with metal in it. <laughs> oh. Oh. We're in. Smooth sailing. <laughs> Right, you're gonna get the other one first, or you're gonna go all the way through? Uh, I'm just gonna work right. my way over. Works on the hood again. It's <laughs> <laughs> on the roof now. What was that? Not working? No, I just don't want to go through the old moon roof. Oh, true. <laughs> Probably not the best place to stand when the roof caves in. Oh yeah, all right, about five more minutes of this, we'll peel her off. She's through. Alright, so instead of cutting all the pillars like last time, we're just gonna cut the roof way quicker. Fire away. Alright, should I stand on the roof? <laughs> yeah. You won't cave in. You got these pillars. Still. I'm a heavy boy. Uh so what you're gonna have to do. Just walk on go to the back maybe, that's more yeah. secure. Maybe I'll get a drill and I'll drill through it so give you a little pilot. Oh, hole. Yeah, that would that'd be key. Do safety squint? Yeah. Definitely loving this new microphone. Did I go all the way? Maybe I didn't. I think you went all the way. Oh no, it didn't make no. it all the way through? It's pretty thick. Okay. There's two layers. I got <laughs> the old grinder. But yeah, loving this new microphone. I apologize for the years of wind noise, but I'm glad they finally came out of a microphone that plugs into your iPhone. There you go. She's windy up here. Breezy one. Catch me if I fall. Whoa, <laughs> don't fall through much. I don't know. Uh. I might have to go back down there to get this guy. Don't be a wimp. You're not going to fall through. Stop. <laughs> uh, first day at the salon, you want to do a cut and color? <laughs> Straight down. Straight down. I know, but the way I'm holding it, I got to go back over there. <laughs> Just waiting for you to fall through. Easy. Does. Easy terms. That's right where the seam is. Yeah. If you're unsure, step on the seam. Yeah. Let's go. Let's go straight down. Yeah. She stops. Because <laughs> you're just throwing all your weight on it. Don't put all your weight on it. There you go. It's, honestly, it's a big gap here. Like, yeah, I, I think know. you're catching on stuff too. It's just, it's a bunch of hollow stuff. I'll come up from the bottom. She's smoking. 
I think you're almost there. I'm through, I just don't think I'm in line with you. Oh. I think I'm a few inches over. We need a bigger disc. <laughs> yeah, the disc isn't big enough. No. Uh, let me see here. Where's the light? We could get the saws all going from the, the oh, window. Oh, I see that. It's because there's three layers. Oh. That's why. Are we through? I couldn't see it, to be honest with you. Oh, yeah, I'm over there. So close. Need a new blade again. Oh, here we go. <laughs> Your arm getting sore. Yeah, I'll just it's caving in, so I gotta <laughs> move back a bit. Well, we're a quarter of the way through, and then I bumped my knee on some broken glass there, and I got a nice little skin flap going now. So some weight on there. There you go. Anyone like blood? So I'm gonna go run grab a bandaid. Before I leak all over everything. Don't worry, I'll get this off before you're back. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Hey, just be wearing glasses. Eh? This is why I always wear work pants. This stuff is sharp. I was gonna say, I usually. I got my work shorts on today. It's warm yeah. out. Just leave it. Let's yeah, keep going. Fine. I know. It seems to be speeding up, not slowing down. <laughs> <laughs> Creative. Yeah, that'll work. Bungee cord. I could be a field medic. Perfect. It's basically better than a band-aid. <laughs> good to go. Let's cut this roof off. No tetanus. Nah, I've had one before. Yeah. <laughs> no need. <laughs> Does it work? Let's see. It works good. Yeah. Oh, perfect. <laughs> All right. Waterproof. Let's, let's continue this roof. Okay, let's get her. <laughs> Yank that thing off. Just using the old rank, yank them rope. Yank them. This yank is amazing. All right, bud. Good to go. Okay. down instead of up. Is that not in it w uh, I guess not. The wheel was moving. No, it's in park. It went down instead of up. <laughs> Luckily no one was in there. <laughs> That's not what we wanted. No. Nope. Hey, it'll work. Though. It'll work though. Yeah. You know, I'm gonna I didn't think it went down at all, so no. I'm gonna get a good run at it. You think it'll go up? Uh, I'm just gonna crunch it back further. Nice. Just so you know, we don't have any. Uh, look, I took the whole headrest. Oh off. yeah. Just shave the foam right off it. Now uh, you don't really want to touch much. It's very razor sharp, as you can see on my sweet Scotch tape job on my knee here. Oh so yeah, bud. We're fixed. We're good to go. Wait, we didn't cut through here. Is that a concern? Oh no, that's the door. Never mind. Yeah, I didn't bother. Yeah, I wasn't, oh, too, I wasn't too worried about that's that. That's okay, because it's just the door anyways. Yeah, because I didn't want to do these pillars. Cut. Yeah, yeah. I didn't even have to do these in general. So we're just making a minor sunroof this time. But yeah, let me get a good run at her. It's a good day for it. Can you pull the rope back when it back up? Yep. And then just center it? Just center it.
Whoa! That was kind of dangerous. There's the rest of it. The Yankum broke. <laughs> the day has finally come. That's actually an achievement, breaking a Yankum. She finally broke. <laughs> and it wasn't the Yankum's fault, it was my fault. This was already half cut from previous times when we did something silly like that and it just got caught on some sharp metal. So it was actually- It was already frayed. It was half cut already. So, but I just obviously- one to use Man, this one I didn't and, even think about that. I should have- uh, Yeah, I wanted to use me. this instead of my brand new one. You know, just cause it's more sharp metal. I don't want to break the new one too, right? Where's that? She's hey. under here. Yeah, it's right here. Yeah. How'd it go underneath? I don't know, man. It, oh, it went wild. It. Should have done a slow-mo on that. Hey, you know how you fix it though. Stop. <laughs> There you go. Not even a fishing knot, eh? Just a nice old. <laughs> <laughs> I'm the worst at tying knots. Uh, all right, give me a minute. We'll figure this one out. Okay. Yeehaw! Okay. I'm getting back. <laughs> Just easily came apart. Worth a shot, I guess. We might need a different knot. Who tied that knot? Oh man, it was double too. <laughs> we need a fishing knot. <laughs> All right, you tie the knot. Okay, I'll try. He's tight. Got a knot going here. Hit the truck. Oh, it broke through the other strap. Holy. The strap snapped. <laughs> I figured. That, that was a good knot, though. <laughs> That's the tailgate. Yeah, as long as the knot worked. Where did it even... Great. Is there another part to that? Yeah, one of the, the other straps snapped. But yeah, like as you can see, we're working with super sharp metal. Yep. So everything breaks. But I'd say that's good enough. Let's, uh, we'll grab the key for it and um, see if we can get it started. Should we uh, crank her up with the crowbar? No, no, she'll be fine. All right. What's this girl going to give us today? Is she going to run? She's got 10 fresh liters in it. My truck said pre-collision assist when I when the rope snapped there. Not even a ding ding. Is it on? Oh, there we go. Okay. Yeah. Give her a whirl. You ready? Yeah. That doesn't even want to start. Hmm. Wonder if we just effed it last time. You barely did anything. I know. What a crappy car. Piece of junk. What did we do? Drive around in circles? Yeah, we literally drove around in circles, packed all that dirt down, got it to the top of the hill, and then as soon as it was at the top, crapped out. Oh. Turn the key fully off, take it out, put it back in, cycle it a couple times. This is for the people that say, why don't you give these, like drive these cars? Because yeah, they don't work. Because they're junk. Your foot's not on the gas, is it? No. Okay. Do you want me to do it? No, take it out again. I smell fuel. I know, and it almost sounds I wonder if it's all like just it. leaking out. You know what I think we're gonna have to do? Since we can't jump this thing, I think we should just roll it over. Do what, we, so. do what we did last time. I mean, that car starts, but it barely moves, so. We can't jump anything today, we're out of cars. All my cars are gone, so hopefully. Oh, no, that's dangerous, Never mind. I'm not jumping my truck. No, I was gonna say, 
put it behind your truck and jump it, but then the rope will still be attached. Yeah. Uh, kind of annoying, but whatever. Oh well, let's do we'll the old flipper room. Make a big mess again. I think we're due for a flip. Yeah. Still got the straps. Oh, and the strap didn't break, by the way. The seatbelt snapped off. Yeah. So I just had it attached to the seatbelt. That's just the end of it. The oh, first okay. one we broke. Don't worry, we still got the brand new Yankum. All right, well, let's... Uh, you want to rip the doors off? Nope. Nope, just, again, flipper. I'm just going to wrap it around a couple times and flip it. All right. Anyways, no jumping for the Equinox, but we got our brand new fresh Yankum rope. This one is rated for 19,000 pounds. This is my favorite one. This is my old one. She's about two years old. She's been worked. We've towed probably 100 cars. Uh, eventually, we got it caught on some, some sharp metal like this, and we broke it. But it actually did still tow a bunch, even though it was half frayed. So we got some crappy straps wrapped around here three times. Our last record for flipping a vehicle was two and a half times, so I got about the exact same amount of gas as last time, about 20k to empty, so I might make it to the gate after, but yeah, we got it wrapped around a bunch of times. Now we're using a soft shackle in case it does break. It doesn't mean I'm going to have metal shackles flying at my truck, so this is the 3 8 by 10 inch, 8,700 8, pounds. So also by Yankum, you can pick them up on their website, so let's test her out. Let's give her. Whoa! That second yank or that first yankum broke. <laughs> he was giving her. <laughs> Did it work? I'm afraid not. <laughs> not broke. Get it? Afraid not? Shit. So our old gone. yankum is frayed in a couple spots, as you can see. So that part broke now. Yeah. So I think we're gonna have to scrap this old yankum and. At least the soft shell shackle held on. Man, that Yankum lasted you a long time. Dude, I took off like a bat of the hell there. That thing would have, <laughs> it wouldn't even like hit the ground when it flipped. It would have just I was going to say, I think we would have yeah. gotten in the air. All right, you want to drag this and I'll back up. Now that I'm probably completely out of gas. So what, you want me to go right on the Yankum? Uh, oh, never mind. We got it. when it gets down there. That is a good question. Oh, it's over on that side. I just want to see this thing flip, that's all. Yeah, she's pretty afraid already. Oh yeah, right, she's afraid. Me... <laughs> she is afraid. <laughs> all right, toss me a rope, I'll, I'll re-noose this one. Double trouble. Oh. This guy, never let Mark tie your boat up. <laughs> hey, I've never lost a fishing lure yet or a boat. Okay, so, so yeah, I'm wrong. I'm just losing cars. <laughs> all right. So we don't want to make the same mistake last time. So we're going to use this. Plus I'm going to grab a floor mat and just throw it over top just in case. I don't want to destroy my brand new Yankum rope. True. Ugh. It is sharp up there. Yeah. Sharp. Sure. Right. Oh yeah. That car is looking sharp. Ugh. Someone tied the door shut. Do that. <laughs> Alright, so we'll put this one here. That should be there good. There we go. Yeah, that's good. You know where that's going? Hopefully, nowhere. Alright, round two. Three, three flips. Alright. Carnage. Any in the air? Like one full in the air, maybe? Yeah, one full That's in the air. That's what I think. Make sure you're filming. Yeah. <laughs> Here it goes. <laughs> and a half. Woo! You were buzzing, too. We only got, like, one. You think? Yeah, it's well, even more than that. It started right there. Well, maybe two. Two and a half, maybe. Yeah. Oh. There's definitely a half going on here. Hey, at least we didn't break the Yankum rope again. You know what? I take back what I said about your your uh, knots there. Yeah. Yeah. You're yeah. a pretty naughty guy. I'm not losing that lure. <laughs> <laughs>
Uh, good old wiper fluid. Yeah. Yeah, pretty standard. Lost uh, headlight. You're right, it's still wrapped around a couple times. Yeah. Maybe it veered off I think when, a when, when it pulled so hard, it kind of crunched itself in, and then, yeah, it turned. We'll yeah, have look to, at that. We'll have to review the game tape. That looks like a belt on me. <laughs> Holy. <laughs> oh. It doesn't help that we cut the whole roof, so look. It, I know. it caved oh, the whole a, thing oh, in. You think you know who's driving, eh? Yeah. But I think we'll hook it up that way. We'll flip it back over, and then we'll call her a day. Okay. Yeah, let's see oh. that. And the soft shackle. So... They're definitely awesome ropes. There's a link below. Don't forget if you guys want it. Discount code. So, all right, let's pop this off. We'll roll it back that way. That yeah, it looks beautiful, <laughs> brand new. She's a little dusty. Yeah, I guess yeah. And you've used it a couple times now, but still. Yeah. It's pretty new. Look at the difference. what we did. What's that? We crossed it when we were wrapping it. <laughs> oh, so it's... Yeah, come over here. There's I'll only say. one side here. So it got like the first one. Yeah. But then, see for the second one, we, oh. some, we somehow crossed it. So that's why I didn't get the full last one. But that's fine. We completely destroyed it. As you can see, she caved in. I would not want to be in here when that happened because you would be a lot worse than my little band-aided up knee right now so anyways we're gonna uh throw throw some throw some plastic back in here drag it over there and send her on the way to the scrapyard and then we're picking up an f-150 i believe monday so it has no box on it no windshield so we're gonna have some fun with it and then send that thing to space i've been putting facebook ads up but facebook doesn't seem to like scrap ads for some reason it's for selling cars not buying cars so Every time I put one up, they take it down three hours later. But usually, I get a few messages right away. So, anyways, thank you guys again. Thank you for the car. Thank you for the Yankum rope. They are amazing. Again, link below. And, uh, yeah, let's have some more fun. And uh, see if we can go get pulled over by the police. We'll see you guys later. Oh, buddy.